Hey, Warpugs, so this is God's Leash from Dead Sound. Now, this was recommended to me during the Shenanigan stream, and I always try to get the things that were recommended during the Shenanigan stream. This in particular, I was looking forward to because, my God, I have enjoyed the entire Autodale series from start to finish. I have enjoyed the series massively. I always enjoy dystopian like, uh, of course, because this channel got started off of 40k, I love dystopian futures, first off, and it's the perfect kind of psychological horror, and, like, mainly because it focuses on brainwashing and the, the entire population of Autodale into being okay with it. One of the worst, most horrific parts of that entire series was um, when, well, I don't want to spoil it for anyone. I really don't, but basically thanking the thanking the robot. And if you know, you know. And if you don't know, you need to watch because my God, it was. I, I just sat there and looked at it, just just utter shock. But um, this has been an excellent series, and ah. Oh, Nothing else to say. War pugs, let's get into it. Dead uh, God's Leash. All of Dead Sounds links are gonna be in the description down below. Please leave a like, comment, subscribe, all that kind of stuff. Let's get into it. Inhale. <sighs> Exhale. Little bird. I can't feel the wind on my face. The ground doesn't feel wet or dry. I can't smell the dirt. It's 21 degrees. It feels like nothing. This room is so familiar. I can't tell how it feels. It's like nothing. It's 21 degrees, so it feels like nothing. It all feels like nothing. Uh. Today's the day. It's a lovely, warm, and sunny day this morning. A steady and comfortable 21 degrees Celsius, as usual. It is coming up for noon, and this morning's weather poll is being counted. Please be aware, people. A sudden and dramatic weather change may occur in the next few minutes. And now, if you'll stand by, a word from our sponsor. Don't think self-improvement body modification program is the easy way to present a new you. The you, you are. Any Tier 3 procedure is free for the first six months. Join billions of satisfied, newly invigorated customers living newer, better lives. Don't think. They are not your faults. It is now 12 a.m. and the lunchtime weather poll is in. It seems like you, the citizens of the United States, have voted for light showers. Thank you, and have a lovely lunch. No. I have the money. You know what you're asking is illegal, right? People aren't allowed in the Havens. I have your money. Yeah, I know. Just been wondering why. The Havens? They're islands. What, you just want to live in the woods? Forever? I don't get it. Does it matter? You said you could get me there, and I can pay. It's cold in the Havens. Except when it's really warm. It's completely uncontrolled. Th the animals there still breed. D disease, mutation, fucking animals breeding freely. <laughs> Is she one of ours? What? Your dinosaur, man. What, what's her name? Her name's Scarlet. Scarlet, huh? Hey, Scarlet, look up for me, will you? 
Now look down. Sit. Good girl. What was that supposed to prove? Oh my Control, god. Control, Sally. You may not like it, but we have God on a leash. And you want to go to the one place we still had lightning strike. You see, there, there's a huge problem with your whole escapist fantasy. Sally, you really think if, if we fried that thing's implants, okay, turned it back into an animal, an animal which is supposed to be dead, by the way, relinquish all control, set it free. You really think that thing wouldn't tear you to pieces? Scarlet, eat Sally. God on a leash. Take me to the havens. I can see why she'd want to go. That's... Mm -hmm. Do it. Everything smells. It smells fucking disgusting. <laughs> it all smells so bad. <laughs> oh, okay. I mm. wait a minute, what? A oh. lot of my early okay. drawings included this character, who eventually became Sally. This it's another It's another bit of just I don't even know what to say. I just don't even know what to say about this. The level of control that they have in this. Now, I'm wondering if this is a pre like he said that everything that he does is a precursor to Autodale. Well, it's part of the Autodale world. So this level of absolute control I couldn't even imagine living I don't I would not want to live in a world like this. I would not want to live like this at all. This is actually disturbing to look at because just the if they can control this, what else do they control? I mean, I don't mm, I don't know. Like at first I felt kind of like iffy. I was hoping that the I was hoping that this little guy wouldn't turn on her, but at the same time, you knew it was coming. You absolutely 100% knew it was coming. 
and to see it happen was kind of distressing. But I understand why. That's the big thing. I understand why. Um, people will just rebel against stuff like that. Against these um, entities that just basically move in to assert dominance. This... This is just another example. Like, I'm just wondering where this falls into the Otterdale story. This guy constantly trying to convince her, hey, stay here. All the while, even the flower on his desk, they are just managing that. Oh, pugs are losing their minds. War pugs, this entire series... The thing I the thing I've said about the auto like the whole Autodale, the everything from Dead Sound is it's not entertainment, it's art. Because it's make it makes you think about legitimately everything that you're seeing. Why you're seeing it, what what all comes because of it. Cat, stop it. She's over there clicking my mouse on my work computer. But to see something like this, it just... <sighs> One of the big things with the Autodale series was that the only thing, the only time you saw color was red. And this, I think, is a precursor to the Autodale series at the end of the day. But that's just me. I don't know. Maybe, I, maybe I'm thinking too heavy into this. But anyway, Warpugs, I'm going to head out from here. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think, if this is a precursor or this is after the fact. All I know is this is things that make you think about our world. They're legit art, and this is legit art. I'll catch you guys next time. Oh my god, I've tried to click a little button like four times. Stop. Nope.